Morning folks, beautiful day here in North Central Ohio and I thought it's about time I got out here and did my unboxing. A couple weeks ago did Family Homestead on one of their live streams on I think it was Sunday night. Did their trivia and the question was where did we travel to? And I think it was that morning. And I just happened to know where they traveled to. And I got in there first, and they went to Tennessee. So uh, I got a shipment of Thrive Life. And I didn't know which, which one they held up. I, I couldn't tell you. I went back and looked at it. I think it was a blue bag. So my package came last week, and this is late coming. I apologize for that. But this is my unboxing of what Big Family Homestead sent us. And I'm not, I'm gonna unbox and show you, but I'm not gonna open it because some of them, some of these items are something I know that our two young granddaughters are going to enjoy. So I'm gonna let them open them up and try them. No problem to devour them an hour but this is what I knew was a blue bag it's Drive Life Express this is wild rice pilaf now I haven't had pilaf in a long long time my mom used to make pilaf but she put raisins in it so I guess it was a sweet pilaf that's the only kind of pilaf I ever knew but this looks like it has um, made celery peas and carrots it looks yummy. I think I will make this tonight as a side dish. I'm going to make uh, pork chops in the air fryer. This will make a good side dish instead of potato. So this is the Thrive Life. I'm going to give this a shot. I've heard very good things about it. So we'll, we'll let you know. And also, uh, Krista sent me some extra goodies. She's a, she's a, a doll. She's a sweetheart enjoyed that Saturday you spent with everybody at the uh, meetup they had down there by their house. It was a wonderful Saturday. This is, uh, they're called freeze-dried snackies. This is very, very parfait. This has uh, oatmeal, blueberries, strawberries, raspberries, and blackberries. Now this one I may hide and eat for myself. I think I'm going to like this one. Then there's also red grapes. Now, years ago when my kids were small, my mother used to take grapes, wash them, put them on a cookie sheet, put them in the freezer and freeze them. Then once they were frozen, she would take them out, put them in small baggies and put them in the freezer. That way, whenever her grandkids came to visit, there were always grapes, frozen grapes in the freezer. And they are a lot sweeter once frozen. That's a thought, especially in the summertime now. Put some grapes in the freezer. They work out great, especially when they're on sale. And the next freeze-dried snackies is strawberries. Now, years ago, in my I used to go to Weight Watchers meeting days. One of the things they had, and they're, they're still out, were the dried bananas and the dried strawberries. That's what got me started on those dried fruits. So. These are, these look interesting. So that's going to, going to be a good snack. Thank you very much, Brad and Krista. I really appreciate that. And then she sent a little goodie in here, which is soap. And before I even looked at her note, I just had a feeling because of the color, this must be lavender. And then when I read her note, and I love lavender, I love my locks. So this, Krista, was perfect. And then, this past Sunday night when they had their, their live stream and chit chat, they posted on there because as everyone knows, they're getting ready to move and they're packing their household up. So the less that they have to move to Wisconsin from Ohio, the better off they're going to be. So they put up their link for their soaps. Well, 
there's a lot of channels that I'm on that sell soaps, and I try to, you know, help, uh, not sponsor, but I help purchase maybe one or two, you know, help the channels out. I mean, I, if, I, if I made soaps, I would like some of my subscribers to do the same. Well, I went and ordered a few lavender soaps. So, these are just, I love them. So, um, if anybody needs some soaps, I know that Big Family Homestead, last I saw, they still had some available. I would suggest you do it. These don't have all the chemicals that stuff does in the stores. And yeah, I got, you know, the Sam's packs in my linen closet that I'm still, you know, caress or ivory or whatever. But I'm, I'm still going to have them in the, in the bathtub, but some of these are just going to be for Nana, for me. These are mine. So, uh, thank you, Big Family Homestead, Grand Krista. I appreciate this. My grandkids will appreciate this. And uh, if you need some help getting ready for your move, let us know. We're available most any day. Just give us a heads up. So we'll talk to you later. Have a great one.